It's time to fire this thing up. Hit it. John, you see what I'm talking about here? My carpet is just trashed inside this boat, and the boat's not that old. What, is it 2015? Correct. What in the world, man? What? Uh, who's spilling stuff on that carpet? You know, I've got two great boys, and all their friends and cousins and my nieces and nephews, and this is a, a family boat. We have a lot of good times on here. But, you know, kids spill things, the boat rocks and they're spilling their juice boxes, food, even upstairs in the seating area where the non-skid is. They're just grinding in the popcorn and whatever you could think. And it's just I, good times, but I love it's, when it's they ruining go swimming, it. okay? Yeah. And, and, and their bathing suits dripping and everything else, and they come in and then the carpet gets, I, I actually yeah, they, don't love that. They, they soak the carpet trying to get to the head to use the bathroom. You can't tell the kid you can't use the bathroom. If you had a magic wand, okay, you would want to get rid of the stained carpet and replace it yes okay i'm going to give you some advice all right if, if you look at the color scheme inside this cabin all right you've got a lot of light color you know in your vinyls and everything else your carpet's also light as well it, it'll hold footprint i mean just from walking around the boat yeah. you know any of that dirt is is going to stay in in that carpet now a solution would be because you have so much light color in here anyway what if you replaced it with darker carpet? Now, the dirt's still going to be there, okay? Right. It's still going to get wet and, and everything else, but at least you wouldn't visually see it. Yeah. What, what, what if we did that? Yeah, it would hide the stains, but like you said, they come down wet all the time to use the head, and it just soaks, and then it smells musty and moldy and nasty. What about teak and holly wood? I mean, beautiful wood down here. That would look gorgeous. It, it would. They're terribly expensive. They add weight. Um, and I found on a lot of boats are very slippery and my wife's not a fan of that because she's afraid of yeah, all kids getting yeah. hurt. You know, I was at the uh, boat show not too long ago and I saw this product. I wanted your opinion on it. It's this here. It's like a woven vinyl. I saw this at the boat show. It was really pretty neat. And the guy told me that this would be waterproof and stain proof um, on the boat. Have you ever seen anything like this? It's kind of like a rubber mat. Yeah. Um, no, who, who, who's the manufacturer? It's this company here called Infinity. Right. And no, I, ha I have not heard these guys, but I could research them. Okay, I'd appreciate would, that. Would you maybe, I mean, if, if, if it can be used as, as the carpet replacement, yeah. go with it? Yeah, I'd love to try it. Okay, Barry Burhoff, one of my friends, as well as the owner of a 43-foot CV, asked me to research a new type of flooring product that I was not familiar with. And I did kind of go online and what I found out is that the parent company is called Twitchell and they're located in Dothan, Alabama. Okay, that's kind of where their headquarters is. They have a subsidiary and, 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 and this is the product. Okay, it's called Infinity. And what kind of blew my mind is they're kind of centered in, uh, in northern Georgia which is where Shaw Industries, they're, they're a huge marine carpet manufacturer. They're, they're in the same town. And I reached out in order to invite them to have all of us learn a little bit more. And, and who we have on the program is Chris Folan. And Chris is the OEM sales manager. You, you work with the boat builders, yes. apparently, uh, providing these different materials. And, and it's not carpet at all. What exactly is, is this made from? I, I have never seen anything like this in, in boating before. This is a PVC coated polyester yarn with right. a vinyl backing. It's a blown vinyl backing. So you antibacterial, antimicrobial. And, uh, it, and it's coated. It's coated. With PVC. Completely encapsulated. So there's no exposed yarns. Will it stain? Like if a juice box fell on this, I mean, could you, would it stain soil at all? And, soil and stain resistant and cleans up very easy. And, and unlike carpet that, that does get wet, mm -hmm. okay, um, and if there's moisture, guys, you're probably going to get into mold and mildew. Absolutely. Th this doesn't absorb any moisture. No mold and mildew. All right. And, and, and the backing is again what? It's a blown vinyl backing. 
Okay. And so it's uh, going to be antimicrobial, antibacterial. Uh, doesn't doesn't retain water. It sheds water very rapidly. It could even float if you dropped it in the water. Okay, so it's got a padding on the back. Are, are there different thicknesses available? Absolutely. We have three different paddings available. Uh, we have an ultra thin, a compact cushion, and a heavy duty. The ultra thin is about a sixteenth of an inch thick. The compact cushion is about an eighth and the uh, HD is about a quarter of an inch. So, so the padding offers shock mitigation? Absolutely. All right. Now, as well now, as some sound, sound deadening as well. Okay, cool. Guys, take a look at some of the different colors and, and some of the different patterns here. This is amazing. You have quite a few products to go with. Um, which, which one again did Barry pick? So Barry chose the grass cloth number two. And the grass cloth number two is gonna have some great color patterns to go with, as well as hide some dirt. I've seen people install marine carpet before where they spread out some adhesive and they put the carpet in place and they kind of work from the center out and with a J roller, they kind of work out any of the voids and they get everything flat. Um, is this how you would install the Infinity as well? There are several ways to install it, but the installation process is basically the same as the Okay, carpet. well, then we're gonna have an issue. Okay, because Barry's carpet is snap-in, and there are a lot of guys out there that have snap-in carpet, and if you can only glue it in, that's, that's not gonna really work. No, we can also do a mat kit as well. So if you want a loose application and put it right in with your snaps, replace your carpet, easy to do. Okay, would you have to put a binding around it? would recommend putting a binding around it. Uh, Sombrella would be a fantastic binding to put around it to protect the edges as well as to add a little bit of style to it. Okay, carpet is sold by the square yard, yes. all right? Do, do you sell yours by the square we yard? We do by the square yard. How, what's the difference? Uh, we're a little bit more expensive than carpet, but our performance characteristics are far superior. It's just simply better flooring. Okay, so Chris, you sell boat builders. Yes. Barry's a customer. I mean, mm -hmm. he's just a regular boater. I'm, yeah. I'm a regular boater. Do you offer this in aftermarket? Absolutely. We work with local fabricators uh, throughout the country, uh, the U.S. and who, who, international. Who would be the fabricator here in Stewart? Uh, Jennifer Highlander is the local fabricator that's doing a fantastic job on his boat. Could you get me in touch with her? Because I think what also might be interesting is maybe I could wrangle her to be on the show and we could actually see Absolutely. how it gets fabricated and then installed in the boat. I'd be happy to do that. Man, that's cool. If somebody at home wanted more information on Infinity, that's, that's what it's called. Yes. How would they get you guys? InfinityLWV.com Stay bolted. Chip Shape TV will be back in a snap. midway in the installation of this new Infinity in Barry Burhoff's boat and welcome back. I wanted to introduce you to the professional installer. Her name is Jennifer Highlander and she owns Highlander Carpet in Stewart, Florida. And you really specialize in the uh, flooring for yachts and boats and all of that. Yes. Um, Barry had some carpet. I know that you guys removed it and you don't really use that as the pattern, you, you template it. What's the material that you use for templating? I use a felt paper. Um, it seems to work better for me. Okay, and you took that back to your shop in Stewart and, and you cut out the new pieces here. Mm -hmm. How easy is it to cut it and what tools would you use for that? Um, it's easy to cut, you just gotta take your time and you gotta use a very sharp blade. Okay. And if you miscut it, it's, it's, uh, you're it's over. getting another piece. So of, you have of to be very careful. Okay. With it. Now, Chris was saying from Infinity that um, uh, he recommends binding the edges with Sunbrella, and I see all the edges here yes. are bound yes. with the Sunbrella. And cost wise, I know you install the carpet on the yachts and the boats mm -hmm. versus this. Is, is this the same with installation costs? Is it a little bit more? The installation cost is about the same. It, when you add snaps, it's a little bit more, but that's just a minute cost. It's okay, well you guys much. are doing an amazing job. You continue on, because I know you want to do some stuff outside as well. Mm -hmm. Well, we're now back at Barry's house and the project is all done, but I want to show everybody at home kind of the before. Yep. Here's the light colored carpet, very stained, kind of trashed. It's been ripped out. Uh, patterned for this new vinyl mat yep and it is now installed and Barry you know I want the audience to now see the result of the work 
but the most important person that we need to kind of impress is you. What do you think of it? I think it looks awesome. And I'm really excited about the fact that I don't have to worry about the kids running around and making a mess on it because it's just going to wipe right up. How comfortable is it to the bare foot? Oh, it, it, it's great. You, you didn't want wood, okay, right. down there. You said, you know, bare, that's not going to be really good. You wanted some cushion. Yep. I think we provided it today. I think it's stunning. I think yep. it's absolutely yeah, fantastic. It's and I think that company, we didn't know about them, but I think that company is really going to explode in the boat flooring business, yes. which is really cool. But we need to thank you and your family. Happy to My help. My friend, we also had Jennifer on, our professional installer. We had Chris from Infinity. So many guest experts in the marine industry, but the most important one that we need to thank everybody, Barry, is everybody at home. Hey, thanks so much for hanging out with us right here on the beautiful, magnificent water's edge for the last half hour. I'm John Graviscus, Barry Burhoff. We'll see you next time around.